This Tech Minute is sponsored by Auto Value and Bumper to Bumper. Visit AllianceOne.com for more information. Hey, today's Tech Minute, we're talking about oil, gasoline direct injection, and carbon deposits. Do you realize the leading cause of carbon deposits on gasoline direct injection engines is actually the vapors in the crankcase that are brought up through the positive crankcase ventilation system? When these vapors hit the back of the intake valve, if they have oil or other unburned hydrocarbons in it, they form carbon deposits due to the high heat on the valve. So how do you prevent this problem from happening? Well, you can't prevent engine blow-by and other vapors inside the crankcase, but the oil is the secret sauce in this combination. If you're using a conventional oil, it has a higher volatility number. This means it's more likely to turn into vapors that find their way into the intake manifold that find their way to the intake valves. If you use a synthetic oil that has a low volatility number, it's less likely to turn into vapors that will find their way into the intake manifold. So if a manufacturer is requiring a certain oil or a certain grade or a synthetic oil for their vehicle that has gasoline direct injection, make sure that you follow it because if you don't and you use a conventional grade, you could be causing a carbon problem on that engine. I'm Andrew Markell. Thank you very much. <laughs>